What about the money? How do you finance this? You say you get a stipend, you get a grant. How, how, where, where should you go if your lab does not have the money ready? What happened to you, Samira? Okay, I can start. Um, so for me, uh, I already the Max Planck Research School grad school that I am with already um, offers part of the stipend for to fund my PhD, um, and it's partly also funded by uh, my supervisor. Although they do encourage in Germany, I think it's more common than in the UK that already your PhD you look for a stipend yourself, so you apply for uh, funding yourself. Because also later on, if you want to continue in research and do a postdoc, then it looks excellent on your CV. Um, the way, so your supervisor will, will encourage you to do this because it saves him or her money, obviously. Um, and there are loads of different ones that might, uh, your supervisor might be uh, a chair or some kind of a reviewer for a type of stipend. So uh, they might be able to recommend some for you. Um, or you can just ask around, really. Um, look at DAAD, for example. They also do a few stipends. Um, there. If you want to look for stipends, there's loads of information that you can find online. One of the biggest, and unfortunately also the most competitive ones, is Böhringer Ingelheim Fonds, um, which is a very privileged uh, funding stipend to get for your PhD. But information like this can be very easily be found by just talking to people in your lab. Yeah, I, I think the DAD came up a, a, a couple of times. That, that's the German Exchange Service, and, and I'm sure I'm sure that that link can be can be found on the blog mm -hmm. or, or otherwise. It's that that yeah. is a central that is yeah. a central place uh, to go. Um, and can you come with your own funding if you don't have money? What happens then? I think that just depends on your supervisor, really. Um, it, it's a very individual based situation. It might be that you're an interesting candidate but they don't really want to fund a certain project that you might be interested in working on at the moment in which case they say sorry perhaps come back later. Um, yeah but personally I haven't really come across a situation like that or know anyone that has no. come across a situation like that so yeah, I, I think that is that is more common in the social science humanities, and and as I understand the system, you can actually come and knock on the door and say, I don't have money, but I really want to do it, and 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 there you go. Uh,